Hey there! In this video, we're showing you how to share downloadable files with your subscribers using nothing but MailerLite. This will let you share things like PDF or ebook lead magnets with your audience easier than ever. And remember, lead magnets are one of the key ingredients to growing your email list. So let's get to it. As always, we start in the MailerLite dashboard and then click on the File Manager tab in the left sidebar. From there, we're going to click on the green upload button. And you can upload PDFs or EPUB files, just keep in mind that there is a 10 megabyte limit on the file upload. All right, then once your file is uploaded, you'll be able to use it in your campaigns and even pop-up forms. So we're gonna create our campaign first. Let's do a regular campaign, this is gonna be a demo. Again, fill out the campaign details the same as you always would. Select your recipients. And then we're gonna go into content and start from scratch. And you'll be able to add the PDF as a hyperlink to any text in your email or to even a button. So we're not gonna edit this demo template right now, but I, do, I will show you how to add the PDF file here. So. All right, so what you're gonna do is highlight the text, and then in the menu that pops up, you'll want to select the hyperlink button, and you'll notice two buttons appear, insert link and insert file. So from there, we're going to click insert file. That will take you to the file manager where you can insert the file that we have uploaded. And then if you haven't uploaded the file yet, you can also click upload here and then you can upload the file the same way that we showed you earlier. But for now, we'll click insert, hit insert, and there you have it. So when your subscribers receive this email, they'll be able to click on this text to download the file. And then if you click on preview and test, preview mode, you can also preview that right here, and it'll show you the file um, as it appears. And if you'd like to do that with a button rather than a piece of text, you can do so by clicking on the button or hovering over when you have the menu appear. Again, click on that link button that appears, and then insert file. Okay, once again, we hit insert. And now this button becomes clickable and then they'll be able to download the file. So we can go to preview once more. And you can see here the button is now a link. When they click on it, file appears. And then as always, our um, designs are mobile ready immediately. So the button is clickable, that link is also clickable. But what if you want to add this file to one of your landing page? So you want to have a direct download on your landing page. Once again, in your MailerLite dashboard, we'll navigate over to Sites. And then we're going to create a landing page. Give your page a name. Save and continue. Select your groups. Alrighty, and then from here, we're gonna start with a template so that we have some pre-filled content. Alrighty, let's say you wanna have the text be the uh, downloadable link. All right, so again, select the text, click on the link, and then from here, normally it says redirect to an external URL. If you click this dropdown, you'll see anchor block, landing page, or file. So here, you can either upload or you can go to the file manager. Click insert, and there is your file. And if you wanna make it a little bit more visible or a little bit more standout, you can always bold that text to make it a pop just a little bit more. And then if you wanna do that with a link, you wanna make this link clickable. Again, when you click onto the link, click this link button, and then the same thing, Go over to the drop down and click file. Go to the file manager, hit insert, and there you go. When we hit preview, you'll notice that this link text 
is clickable. And then the button is also clickable. So let's say you want to give your subscribers a freebie after they've given you their email on a pop-up form. To do that, head over to Forms. And then we're going to create a new pop-up form. Call it pop-up form freebie for now. Make sure you have pop-up selected under Type. Then hit Save and Continue. Select your group. Hit Continue. Just pick a template for now. This is the pop-up form. What we're gonna do is customize the success page. So after they submit their email and hit join now, on the success page, you can give them access to that file. So what you could do, let's go ahead and customize this text just for uh, context. Then we'll customize this text. Okay, so once again, we're gonna select the text, hit this link button, click on the dropdown where it says external URL. Then not landing page, we're gonna go to file. You can either upload or go to your file manager. Again, we've uploaded our file, so go to file manager and hit insert. Alrighty, but what if you want them to have to click a button in order to get the file? You can do that by dragging over the button block. Let's center that. Alrighty, and then again, hit the link or attach button. Go to the drop down, select file. And then same thing from the file manager, we will insert our freebie. So we can go ahead and preview it. Alrighty, and now we can access the files when they click here. File will download. If we click the button, same thing. And that is how you add a freebie to your pop-up forms. Whether you're collecting leads or just want to give a little something to your subscribers, it's easier than ever to share files with them. What kind of download are you offering? Let us know down in the comments. And if you found this helpful, remember to like and subscribe for more of the best tips in email marketing.